Hi, it's Dave Robinson with PlantCoverCrops.com. Uh, I'm in a test plot in northwestern, northeastern Indiana on the 12th of April, uh, 2012. In this pocket over here to my right, we had uh, cereal rye, oats, and turnips, and, uh, and then the strips of wheat that uh, we had that was uh, volunteer wheat behind the combine. And then uh, we had very good kill on all of that. In fact, there's uh, absolutely no green at all uh, out here in this section. And then we come over to uh, where the ryegrass was, a very beautiful stand of ryegrass. And uh, in sections, it's absolutely beautiful kill, and yet we still have some escapes. Um, probably a few more escapes over here than what we had in the area that I looked at previously in a video. So um, just the fact that the uh, annual ryegrass is a little more difficult to kill. No one's uh, questioning that, but uh, the fact that we uh, might have sprayed just a tad bit early because again there were some ryegrass shoots, young shoots, coming up underneath where the um, where there had been some frosted off material on top. Got really quite a bit of green tint out here in this section. You can see it was a beautiful stand of ryegrass. Uh, we had lots of earthworms in this section as we've seen in previous videos. And again, if you're just looking at it, just a drive-by, uh, boy, it looks like it's just toasty brown. In fact, when it came up to the plot, I thought, man, that's fantastic. Well, now we're starting to see this green tint and uh, enough green plants that for sure this needs a second application just to make 100% sure we don't have any escapes. And uh, because those escapes uh, turn into seed producing plants and that's certainly not what we want. We actually in this section have a little bit of wheat that also uh, has a, uh, you know, a few escapes there too. So uh, not exactly sure if this is just uh, well, you can see green all the way, all the way up through here. Sorry about the fast moving camera there. But uh, yeah, so I think this is a good candidate to be sprayed again. And uh, not just to drive by and say, hey, it looks great. Because yeah, it looks great, but it's not dead. At least a good portion of it's not yet. Okay, Dave Robinson with PlantCoverCrops.com looking at, at uh, chemical kill. And what a overall pretty darn good job. Excellent job, actually. On getting winter, on getting things uh, starting to be killed, now we just got to finish it off.